Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Learn Math with Mr. Saad. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 2, lesson 9. Multiply by one digit numbers. Page number is 131. Guys, before starting today's lesson, don't forget to subscribe my channel Learn Math with Mr. Saad and also press the bell icon to get notified for every new video. Okay. Let us start today's lesson as by the name of the lesson, all of you know it, very simple, multiply by one digit number, here, like you are multiplying it by one digit number, 38 times 4. All of you know the procedure, four, first you multiply this 4 with 1s, then with the 10s, 4 times 8, 32, write 2 here and 3 up carry, then 4 times 3, that is 12, 12 plus 3 equals to 15 so 152 how you can check your answer you can check your answer by dividing 152 with 4 if you get 38 it means your answer is correct yeah. let us move to the next page here it is uh, they're doing estimate. The estimate of 317 is 300, and this one 5, 300 times 5, 1500. Okay, let us multiply actually 317 times 5. 5 times 7, 35, 5 here, 3 up, 5 times 1, 5, plus 3, 8, and 5 times 3, 15. So 1585. How to check our answer? Divide this total with 5. If you get 317, it means your answer is correct. Here it is. Okay. Yeah. This one now. Uh, multiply 42 times 2. This one they are doing estimate. Estimate of 42. 40. 42 times 2. 80. Uh, four, 2 times 2, 4, and 2 times 4, 8, 84, uh, closer to the estimate, so reasonably. Okay, here also they are doing it closer to the estimate. Okay, let us move to the next page, independent practice. I will show you one question here, and remaining all you guys have to solve by yourself. No need of this estimation, cross this, you can just multiply, okay? And remaining all solved by yourself and then you can match your answers from this video here 3 times 1 3 and 3 times 2 6 6 times 2 12 2 here 1 up 6 times 3 18 and the 1 up 19 192 hello boys continue solve all these questions and then match your answers from this video So this was page 132. Now let us move to the next page. Here, 1747 airplane. Uh, it's the name of plane, guys. Okay. So no, this is not a number. It's a name. Can carry 420 passengers. How many total passengers can three planes carry? So 420 times three. 420 times three. 1260 okay in an auditorium there are nine rows of seats with 18 seats in each row so 9 times 18 162 there are also six rows of seats with 24 seats in each row so 6 times 24 144 so how many seats are there in the auditorium so you will add these two 306 seats no need of estimation guys okay uh, malia bought 14 cans of cat food each can weighs 8 ounces so 14 times 8 112 ounces catalina multiplied 842 and 3 and got 3326 which is wrong guys when you multiply 842 by 3 you will get 2526 how can she check to see if her answer is reasonable 
write a number sentence to support your answer now you I told you on the first page how to check your answer so you have to check your answers and let me know in the comment box how to check your answer about question number 17 okay guys here yeah, well. question number 18 what is the procedure for multiplying by a one digit number multiply the ones as I told you first we multiply the ones and tens and regroup if needed continue if there are any hundreds thank you so much guys I hope you understand the lesson and if you really understand the lesson don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel learn math with Mr. Sam thank you so much have a nice day